What I'm going to show you here is how to cut a mount with a bias on the bottom. That's a slightly wider margin. Um, it's a feature in mount cutting that I particularly like. And most of the mounts I cut, I have a little wider margin at the bottom. Then depending whether it's a portrait or landscape, Normally I just mark a cross for a portrait mount on the bottom. Uh, but what I'm going to do here is actually write the dimensions down so it helps you keep track of what I'm doing. So we're going to use 75 millimeters on the bottom or about three inches. And we're going to do 70, 70 and 70 on the other three sides. And the method I'm going to show you is the easiest, quickest way of cutting this with a minimum number of stops. Um, it's certainly the, it's the quickest way and also the less number of times you're changing the stops gives you less chance of getting it wrong or moving the stop the wrong way. So I'm going to start with the widest margin, 75. On the map guide there. I'll position the board in the machine, lower the arm down. The two sides need to be 70. So we set the start and finish stops at 70. Then we cut down with the finger gauge to the edge and cut. We now do the opposite side. This one is now 70, so we need to change this to 70. Having changed that, we never touch that one again. Into the bottom of the machine, lower the head. The two sides, they're still 70, 70, 70, so we don't need to change those. Down and cut. Now we've just turned it through 90 degrees. You can go either way around, it doesn't matter, but I prefer to bring the wider margin down to the bottom, lower the cutting head. 70, I say, we don't need to use that. We have 70 here, but we need 75 at the bottom. So we now move the bottom stop to 75. Double check, 70, 70, 75 and cut. And now for the final cut, turn it through 90, lower the head. So this is the final cut and this is the only time you need to change two of the stops. This one was 75, we need to take that back to 70. And this one, a wide margin needs to go to 75. And cut. And there we have the portrait mat or mount with a bias on the bottom.